they're going to be using bombs that have timers and they will time their bombings so this tactic is totally different to what they're doing at the moment this is pretty unusual uh, when you consider the recent attacks that we've seen across Europe we've seen knife attacks we've seen vehicle attacks suicide bomb attacks but we have yet to see of late this kind of IED attack and the device really is at the center uh, of this investigation they're going to be using bombs that have timers and they will time their bombings that it was a, a timer that was that was on this device it implies a sort of aspiration but i will say what, i will say one thing that doesn't fit the mo of the attacks we've seen this year the attackers have been present it, there were basically suicide missions even the stabbers this is something slightly different the fact that it was a remote kind of effort to remotely detonate something so i find that interesting i don't know if you no, I, I do too and yeah. I, I think it's, it's very interesting terrorists will change their tactics when it comes to um, bomb attacks and all that. The only thing that I can say is that this isn't the typical modus operandi of things that we've seen in the past. Uh, the attacks you, you highlighted before I came on have typically involved individuals uh, who want to commit suicide during the attacks. They want to be um, killed and this is a, you know, uh, the uh, modus operandi we've seen in this case is, is a bomb being essentially left and, and the individual at large. And it's fun for them to see government officials or law enforcement panic trying to find where the bomb is. Now, the fact that a timer was used and the suspect is still at large has Londoners bracing for the worst. The timer is really what's freaking people out. And did this individual place bombs in other locations? I mean, they are obviously sweeping all the train stations in London, all the tube stations right now at this particular time. Uh, they're looking for other devices. I don't know why they will change up their tactics later on in the future. I'm thinking that it's just to cause more fear in people. Uh, we understand from a British security source that a timer was found on that device, which is raising eyebrows because it suggests whoever created it, whoever planted it, was not on board the train at the time of this explosion, which is perhaps why we're hearing from the London mayor that there is a manhunt underway in the capital tonight.